Portsmouth has had 87 shootings this year. That's according to the Gun Violence Archive. In the Chief's Quarterly Forum, Chief Stephen Jeekins says that the city is in talks with ShotSpotter and another company called Raven to address shootings in the city. Why did the Portsmouth Police Department decide to bring ShotSpotter to the area? So we're, we're looking at uh, programs like ShotSpotter um, and, and also the other one I mentioned, Raven. Uh, by uh, by Flock Industries. It will allow us to hopefully put our officers in the right place uh, when those incidents happen. ShotSpotter and Raven are technology that recognizes and pinpoints the location of where gunshots are fired, helping respond to crime faster. So we can hopefully get officers to that area as soon as possible and there where there's no confusion between a firecracker or a backfire, but actually gunshots. The city is in talks with both companies, ShotSpotter and Raven for the technology. Right now we're, we're still in the procurement phase. Uh, we've done a lot of uh, due diligence with the companies um, and had them come out and do demos. I think we're further along with one than the other. Jenkins says two programs will be put in schools to help deter crime. The GREAT program in middle schools, which stands for Gang Resistance Education and Training, and the RESPECT program in Portsmouth High Schools, a nine-month program starting this fall. The GREAT program was something that we started doing training on last year, and so we're looking to do full-fledged, full blown out into uh, it, the up-and-coming school year, and so uh, Look forward to it. Uh, look, the, uh, the officers are excited about it. And uh, so we're looking to partner and hopefully with the school system that they'll uh, embrace, the, embrace it. Earlier, I caught up with Chief Jenkins at a community walk on Jenkins Place after a woman was shot and killed Sunday and a man seriously injured. He's encouraging citizens to get involved and to say something if they see something. We want to reinvent um, the uh, community watches and see if we can't bring those back. They were very successful in the past. Uh, they, we've gotten away from them, and if we can re-engage with that, I think we could have some success. Chief Jenkins tells me that police will be giving blink cameras to residents to put at their front doors to address crime starting next week. Now, the city is paying for a one-year membership for residents to have these cameras. In Portsmouth, Leandra Head, News 3.